Thursday morning, 7 a.m. Here's where I was yesterday. We've got the news going live with the Mayor Steve Krieg. A lot of debris and rubbish have, have washed up. This is unbelievable. I actually woke up this morning thinking this was a dream for a split second. Round two. The water wraps its way all around the side here. Wow, the water is just so still. So the Lismore City Council said that the river peaked at 11.4 metres yesterday and it's been going down since about 5 p.m. very, very slowly. Last time I checked, the river was sitting around uh, 11. It could be a bit less than that now. I will put the link to the, the river height just below. They predict that the water may drop below the 9.7 a uh, major level by this afternoon. So here we are at the square. <sighs> Talk about deja vu, huh? To be here a month later, looking at the exact same thing, I'm speechless. That's a shit ton of water. Vet sign poking up the top. Now here we are on the other side of the square. It's come up here as well. Now, if you can remember last time, the water level was that, well, you can still sort of see where the water level was a month ago. So that's a comparison of how far this flood's come up. So this takes you up to the traffic lights, just up here. I'll see if I can swing around and come down Ballina Road and get over the other side of this. And here we are on Ballina Road as you come down the lights so the 2017 flood was what 11.6 and this one was 11.4 noticing though this water isn't as like browny black as uh, the other stuff was although unfortunately on the night of the 29th there was Reports of a woman trapped in her car in flood water. Emergency services were unable to locate the woman or her vehicle, which was last seen on Wairala Road, about five minutes south of Lismore near Moultrie. So please guys, if you can keep an eye out for a, a white Holden Captiva station wagon, uh, New South Wales Rego YHS 51F. And be sure to contact local police if spotted, obviously. Also, I thought it was appropriate to Rock the Lismore shirt today. So you can pre-order these shirts on Shea Maid's website. I'll link below. So with all the profits going to flood relief, and of course, look after yourselves and each other. Stay safe.